all right hi everyone so there is one interview question uh, one of my student got that is can we insert multiple objects via a single dml statement so experience of candidate was around two years company name i think it was a startup most of you might already know the answer that yes we can do that we can insert multiple objects uh, uh, record in a single dml statements for but for all the people who don't know this or haven't tried this i thought that i'll create a practical video and do it in front of screen so that this might this might help you okay so how do we do that is first let us create multiple records so i'm creating a new account or uh, let's say uh, account ACC uh, let's call it new account is equal to new account we'll be creating an instance of it let's give it a name so name is going to be let's say test account and let's create a contact uh, let's call it new contact create an instance of contact let's give it a last name because last name is a mandatory field for contact uh, let's call it test contact and then we will not be doing insert new ACC and insert new contact we will not do that instead what we will do we will create a list okay uh, though Salesforce's case insensitive always try to create list where L is capital uh, okay and uh, this is going to be S object so we'll create a list of S object let's call it records to insert and then create an instance of it let's call it S object and here we are going to add new account and new contact all right so let us comment these we are not going to use them instead we will be using an insert on records to insert okay so what we did we created an account we created an instance of a new contact and then we created a list of s object and added those account and contact there and then we are doing the insert okay so that's what we are trying to do let's execute it and it was successful let us go through contact earlier there was no contact if i just refresh it you will see a test contact has got created similarly if we go to account a test account will also get created okay now let us try to see if we can update as well okay so I will copy the account ID and we will again go back to the same uh, anonymous window and here <coughs> now I will provide the ID as well okay similarly for contact also I will do provide the ID so let's copy the contact ID and instead of this let's give an update on their name and instead of insert let's call it update and execute this so we are checking if update insert is working we are finding it sometimes they do ask okay insert does work we know that can we also do update absurd and delete so we are just checking that just going on one level up let's refresh this and name has been updated same goes for account as well name has got updated so update will also work absurd will also work so let's try to now do the delete and see if if it works or not okay so delete will also work 
now if you go to account and refresh it there will be no contact okay because the, the account has got deleted so when they ask in an interview can we um, uh, do uh, an insert on multiple s object with a single dml statement yes we can do not just insert we can also update we can also delete when we create the list of s object how you do that i have just shown you try to practice it if you don't know this already if you know this do do uh, uh, follow and share it with people who you feel that they don't know this thank you